Hey there everybody, Fat here, and welcome back to Fat Plays The Darkest Dungeon. Last time, we took out some Otoroshis in the Southern Isles. It was pretty great. Rathburger, Chibi, Bendul, Riley went out, busted some heads. Unfortunately, one of those was of a kid with tofu. Chibi didn't like the tofu. So, uh, he had to, uh, he had to go fu. And now, this guy's mad. As you can see. He's planning on taking his revenge here in the hamlet. We're gonna stop him. You know what? When in doubt, religion comes out. We got Quercus, Campion, Wendigo, and Tang Sock today. Gonna help us out. Quercus, you're gonna have the inspiring cry. It's gonna be a big part of your strat. You're also gonna use Zealous Accusation, because if I remember correctly, and I'm pretty sure I do, this is kind of a wave-based mission. So we're gonna want Zealous Accusation. We're gonna want the double slaps. Campion, I think we just go with the Thwack. I really like the Thwack. Also, a couple of moves that last the whole battle are pretty darn good. He is kind of a, you know, set up his buffs and then slap away kind of guy, but hey, it's the kind of guy it works. Wendigo, you're always one of the hardest ones to equip. Only because I don't know if I want to go with proselytize. I don't know if I want to go with marks. I don't, I, you don't, you never know. But you know what? I think we don't want benediction. I don't think that does anything for us. You know what? I'm going to take the mark. I'm going to take uh, the mark buffing move, the move that uses the mark, and I'm going to take Ashes to Ashes. And Tank Sock, I don't ever need to change anything on the Vestal's kit, because the Vestal has a perfect kit. The Old Man's Procession. Unfamiliar junks appear in the distance. That means boats. Uh, an impending battle seems to draw near. Prepare to defend the hamlet from this new force. Alright, let's prepare. To start with, got this, uh... Wait a minute. We got this new glorious standard. It's glorious. Stress resist, move resist, stress heal, heal heal. It's great. Damage, accuracy, it's great. More heal heal, or stressy heals, it's great. I don't need this. Uh, HP, it's great. 68, couldn't give him one more. We don't need healing skills at all. No, wait, we don't have melee. That's right, this is, uh, this is a ranged attack. Wildly enough. Campion, you're next. Oh yeah, you're gonna get Durendal. Yeah, you're, you're gonna slap. He does lose a lot of healing skills and healing received on hit. But I think that's fine. I think he'll be just fine. He can stress on any action. Seems pretty broken. Here, get some of that healing skill back. And then get some HP. Yeah, you're both going to have a ton of HP. We got a tanky front line. Which is what you want. Extra damage and stun skill chance gets marked, but less crit. I'd rather... I think I'd rather have the crit. So in position two, if you have this Phantasm, you get extra accuracy and crit, which he's not in position two, but he's in position three. So we get two extra HP healed, and then ten dodge. A ten dodge seems pretty good. Uh, obviously the HP healed not useful in this particular day and age. So just give me the dodge. That's that's good too. Thanks, Sock. Obviously. This idol, too good. This diary, pretty good. This, these, not that good. Okay. Quercus, I'm gonna have you take the edge, because I want you to get that that overtime buff. I want you to get stronger as the battle goes on, as as you can imagine. And after that, let's give you a little bit of accuracy and stress resist. You are the frontliner after all. And then you can have some extra accuracy and crit as well. And then actually have some extra crit. I, I meant accuracy and damage, but you can also have some extra crit. This actually works out pretty darn... Look at these numbers, man. Numbers are nuts. Uh, I could have given him the Brass Bugle as well. He is our main stress healer, so you know what? I'm gonna give him that over this little bit of accuracy. And that little bit of accuracy can, can come over here to Campion. Along with a little bit more health. Along with, um... What else do you give the guy who has everything? He doesn't need... In my opinion, he doesn't need, like, stealth. He could use more accuracy, as could we all. So I guess damage and accuracy seems like the best. Oh, yeah, Ancestor's Pen. That's what we want. Hell yeah. I could give him a lot of reflection, and I know this. After all, he does give himself 80% reflection. And a lot of minus crits received, too. I just realized I didn't give anyone the frog. Uh, you know, I'm going to give up that extra health for the frog. I think that's probably worth it. We have a lot of healing, and 60... Over 60 health is a lot in any position. 
So yeah, I think we go with that. It's a bit of a toughie, though. There's also 35 stress resist sitting right here, too. Not... Nothing to sneak it. Sneak at? Nothing to... S I almost said sneak again. <laughs> nothing to sneeze at. You know what? I'm giving him more damage reflection. He does get stress when hit, but we, have, we got a boy in front that helps with that. So... Take it over this healing. Oh my lord. Look at all that damage up in here. That, that, is, that is potential damage on the enemy. That is a ton of potential damage right on their face. I kind of want to just give them more health now. You know what? I'm going to do it. Um, give, him, give him the gladiator helmet. He doesn't need the prot necessarily, but I do want him to... I do want him to have the HP. This this is gonna be this is gonna be a thing. This is gonna be a big old thing. The only bad part really is the minus healing skills under Rendell. Do we really need it though? I mean, do we need to build him for damage at all? I could just give him less crits received, and now he'll never get crit. <laughs> I mean, never, but he'll still get crit a lot because it's the darkest dungeon. But I mean. He's got minus eight here. Wasn't there something else giving him minus crits received, or did I... I thought he had something else. It was, it was the thing I... No, it wasn't the thing I just had to equip. No, it's his move! That's what it is! Yeah, and this also gets rid of his dodge, which is good. We don't want him to dodge if he's gonna tank every hit. Dear God, do I do it? I think I will. This is going to get nuts really quickly. Okay, when to go? We can finally look at someone else. For, oh, there's more here, too. I'm getting rid of the pen. I got I to gotta do it. I got I to gotta, I gotta commit 100%. When to go? You throw down damage, marks, stress, heal, and proselytize. So I think the marks are the biggest thing that you add to the party. And you know what? Thunderblade would be great. Because then you can lower stun and move resist while marked. Does that really do much for us? <laughs> Honestly, no. But hey, it lets me use the thing that's attached to the thing. So I'm going to take it. What can I say? Let's see. There's also more health here if I wanted it. At this point, I don't think I need more. I am going to give you more dodge. Someone should use it. Actually, you have... You do have this single target move. You know what? You're the best candidate for Grail. You can make someone else guard you. Kind of makes me wish I had Benediction equipped, but honestly, Proselytize is probably good enough, With even though it has that big-ass cooldown. This should work. It should still work. So what else do you give the guy who has everything? Uh, you don't lower his speed anymore. He's already down to four speed. Give him an Aria box, because I feel like we should have that spread around. He does not get Last Light Martyr's Halo. He just, he just doesn't. Sorry, dude. How about the sun equipment here? Yes, we haven't equipped that in a while. Where's the bracer? I always lose track of the sun bracer. Do I have the sun bracer? Did I lose the sun bracer? I might have lost the sun bracer. Or I'm just going crazy. Losing my mind. Yeah, there it is. I'm definitely losing my mind. Thanks, Sock! You know what you're getting. You're getting the freaking syringe. You're getting the... Gosh dang, you know, I'm gonna give you Eerie Eye for 12 accuracy, because you also have stuns. Well, a stun. So you're gonna get the Brass Nux as well. You're gonna get the Ancestor Scroll. And then you know what the last two are gonna be. Last Light, Martyr's Halo. Bada bingus, bada dingus. We at least we'll probably never die until we do. Alright, let's do this fight. We don't need food. The game knows it, so it's not even gonna try to give it to us. We're gonna grab a lot of other things, though, to keep us alive. Grab the Omomoris. You know, we have a lot of major ones, too. Grab a couple. Don't need the key. Probably don't need the holy water. We'll take the torches. We'll take some nightmare flower bouquets. And we'll go kick some butt, hopefully. Let's find out if that's the case. Oh, the caretaker just kind of chilling next to the flame. The, uh... Nrari, the bad guy, is crashing the game, as you can see. Why did you do this? Why why would you do this to me? On this day of all days. I'm recording this on a holiday. In the US. 
the ironically named Labor Day, at least, you know, on its face. Well, I guess we'll try again. Let's go ahead and load up the 69th estate and see if we can go into the mission. I don't know, maybe it put us into the next week. Heroes could be renamed and recolored in the character panel. If you, if you didn't know that. Now you do. It's pretty great. A little bit of customization. It's a, it's a good thing. It's actually really fun. That's all I got right now. I mean, I mean, I didn't expect it to crash. I don't think it crashed. Last time I went into this mission. I could be wrong, but I don't think it did. Um, okay, let's just grab a bunch of stuff. There. Go. Take two. The dude is known for having control over other spirits and humans. He's too frail to attack you physically. Watch out, as he could make use of your game files by attacking them directly. I don't know why this is crashing now. But I guess we can't go on this mission. Well, I got this whole team set up for like a really fun mission idea. Or at least a really fun, you know, party. What do you do with them then? I guess we gotta take them somewhere else. I mean, come on, have you seen their equipment? They're really freaking cool. I have to try them. Uh, what, 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 do you, what do you do? What do you do instead? Um, I know the Hag Witch is still out there. We don't need to take her out right now. And honestly, this is not this is not a good team to do it. Better team to do it is actually going to be um, Reynold, Dismas, Aykroyd, and Michelle. And that's because we need two damage dealers who can hit the back row. So, this is not a good candidate. No, it's too bad we're gonna miss out on a legendary bracer. There's a... There's a large rock activation mission here. That's cool. Um... We could go fight some meat. And get a nice bandana. Or we can try the rift dungeon. Retreating will result in the destruction of several building upgrades. If you are not ready, don't try this quest. We have massive stress heal. Massive, uh, okay, damage, actually, but massive reflection. Big damage buffs over time with the marks and the proselytize. And huge heals. I think we're about ready for this one as we can get. Bring all the food, bring all the shoves. I don't remember what this has. I just know that it's an extra hard mission. Designed to be. So, you know, spare no expense, if you don't mind. Except holy water, we'll we'll spare that. Let's try the rift dungeon instead. This icon means it's going to be fun. <laughs> rift dungeon is a hardcore challenge. Retreating will result in the destruction of several building upgrades. If you are not ready, don't try this quest. Now I think I remember this one before. Yeah, it's a straight line. Uh huh. If I remember it correctly, this is going to be hell. Because you practically... Okay, except when you get fights like this. Um, you practically had to have a team that was just absolute balls-to-the-wall cheating, basically, to beat this previously. It, it was an in-game dungeon. I wonder if it still holds up to, you know, eight trinkets and all this stuff. Let's go for a stun. I don't know. We can we can bypass stealth. Hey, let's do maximum damage, minimum frick. Great start, tank sock. Feeling good about that. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of proselytism. Let's get that now. Don't, don't get the mark. Don't get the block. I should say. Get the block on Quercus because Quercus can slap back regardless of what happens with the block. So that's ten damage in, nine damage on the slap back. He's bleeding, and he took. 23 damage back on 10. That's awesome. And the 40 prot doing a lot of work here, too. Yeah, shoot me. I dare you. Holy shit. A 38 damage slap back. Keep in mind, this is a vanilla team, so they're gonna. They're not the toughest. Get the light, the promise of safety, and get us that torch. Eight is pretty good. With a 6-plus on top of it, 14 all-team, every-time team. 
Uh, you know what? Keep the slapbacks going. That was phenomenal. That was goofy good. Uh, hey. Now hit him harder. <laughs> yeah, do it. Mmm, a trade of one for 41. That seemed fair. Oh my god. Get out of my house. Size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Holy crap. This expedition at okay. Least promises success. The fight should get crazier very soon. There's a meat cart. There's a loot cart. It looks like meat. Oh, it's a healing potion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. HP and stress relief to everybody. Just, we don't need it. Uh, but we got it. Gotta keep that torch up for, uh... Is that a Vestal? Um, I was gonna say, yeah, for Wendigo. 50% HP heal. Okay, that's pretty good. Now we might start needing it. Here should be new enemies. Yup. A hostage? The... Bloody Twins and the Ascended Witch. Alright. Get the witch. The twins have 92 health each. Warning, don't kill the hostage. You got it. <laughs> if you say so, buddy. Let's go ahead and get that proselytize going. This seems like a fantastic scam. Uh, hit me. You won't because you're cowards, but hit me. Or hit me! Hit us! The light will protect us. Star is born. That's a crit. Mm. It's a little bit of stress. Double throwing daggers. That one at least wasn't a crit. It does stress as a regular hit. That sucks. Fate's reveal. As the fiend falls, you didn't see that fate, did you? Blossoms. Release me. Help. Uh-oh. That's not good. Actually, what am I talking about? This is great. I don't... This team is purpose-built to fight this enemy group. Because they don't have to attack the team at all. They just have to sit back, mark them occasionally, and then go for slapbacks. That's it. And damage reflection. As long as the hostage can't actually attack us, this fight's in the bag. Yeah, hit me. You fool! How dare you! Oh, right, because I told you to. The only problem is eventually Campion has to either attack or move forward or backwards. Help. Okay. Whoa, God, that's not good. All right. Gotta look out for that. Tank Sock can, of course, attack the enemy. 13 in. That's the bleed. And 30 out! Oh, man, I love it. I have a little bit of perdition on you. Keep hitting me. Come on, you cowards. Ah, uh, you know what? I guess this is the chance for lay on hands. Have some help. It says thank. Yeah, stab me. Nine in, twenty-five back. Oh wow, that is a big ass bleed. All right. So far, so that is a huge bleed. Um, keep the slapbacks coming. The only thing that might screw us up is if he uses help on Quercus and Quercus is allowed to hit him back. I don't... Ooh. I don't know if that works that way. 16 in? Come on. 37 back! Stab me. Worth it. <laughs> Didn't even get the bleed, thank God, because that bleed is brutal. Wait, the other one just died? Uh... Okay. What are you gonna do, buddy? A momentary yeah, we need to heal. <laughs> Needless to say. Now what? Are you gonna say thanks? Here, uh, that- well... It says don't kill him. Now that, that you can't hit him. Help. Uh, we're just, you know, we're just paying our respects to our fallen foe. Release me. Hey, hey! That was awesome. Trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. I loved everything about that. Mainly because we had the right team to fight it. We lucked out so hard there. If I had taken like a regular slapping team, we would have been screwed. Dude, that deep lurker looks amazing. He has no animation though. He's just kind of rocking back and forth. He looks great though. <gasps> 
I look forward to his 40 damage bleed. I don't remember what they do. I really don't. Maximum damage! Tank Sock is rocking it with this maximum damage. Uh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta proselytize. This, this setup, this, this formation feels like the perfect scam. They just absorb damage and then turn it into more damage. Three damage in. Is that enough to kill him? <laughs> oh crap. All right. Six damage in to, in, to Campion. 14 back. Minus 100% death blow resist. Well, that's not good. <laughs> For three rounds. Wow. I hate him. A lot. I mean, it's not like we're dropping... Oh, wow, 10 damage in. I mean, it's fine. Campion has the health. I don't know if you knew this. 23 back. Oh, thank you for dodging that. That's a ton of damage back there. Check out the Guiding Star. The blood Which is good because we need that stress resist right now. Okay, if you're starting to feel it on the stress front, and I might have to take, you know, ashes to ashes. Dirt to dirt. Get out of here. Yeah, we're going to do it. We do lose the slap back this round from Quercus, but it's worth it for the 17 stress seal going on right there. Uh, bonk him. Big bad bonks, baby. With a triple crit heal. To oh, I didn't mean to heal there. Frick. I was kind of enthralled by that triple crit heal. This team is actually godlike. I, I guess it's appropriate that they're the religious team. What the fuck is going on? This might be our A team. Like, de facto. I mean, look what they're doing! This is supposed to be an extra hard dungeon. And they're just kind of waltzing through it so far. The enemy should get harder as we go on, and it does culminate in a quote unquote boss fight. So it will get harder, but good god, I can't believe it's gone this well already. Brawler, champion, witch, witch. Okay, so. Other than the ascended witch, honestly, honestly, they're. Even the Ascended Brawler, I think, is a regular enemy. This is just a regular enemy group. It's a pretty strong one. They're obviously top-tier versions of these enemies. But this is a regular enemy group. Which I think is normal in the hallways. False sense of security and whatnot. Great damage! I was really open for a crit, so we could have gotten a second move, but I'll take it. Um, yeah, give me the proselytize anyway. Because you're probably going to get hit at least once. And now that you're also guarding Wendigo, you'll definitely get hit at least once. Okay, one damage in. The bleed. And two damage back. I mean, that that makes sense. Nice dodge, Quirkers. I'm happy we didn't waste the block on that. There's the rend. There's the bleed, which we can accept. Rend for the new god! Oh, no! They're... They're worshipping all the gods over here. Yeah, pull me. Oh, wait, I'm already here. Ah, crap. We have, like, my... Yeah, plus 60% stress right now, and a huge bleed. You killed the wrong one, but I, I'm okay with it, because at least one of them died. No, you killed the right one. He, this one doesn't have a move. I guess you killed the right one. I'm not entirely sure it works that way, but I'm gonna say it does. A little bit of Guiding Star... Guiding light, a little bit of ashes to ashes, dirt to dirt. Give me that stress relief and put on a shirt. Uh, no. Yes. Oh, wow. I did not expect that to do eight damage, even on a crit. Okay. Get the kill. What is this crit team, man? Uh, give me the single target. We need the help. I feel a lot better now. Even better! You don't belong in this world! Satan! Alright. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Swine Berserker. Pinky! <laughs> Pinky looks great. A Skyver. I'm I 
I don't know what Pinky does, but for some reason I'm still worried about the Skyver most of all. He is a human beast, unholy, and eldritch. What in the hell is this thing? It scares me. It scares me actually a lot. Although maybe not as much as this guy. I know the type of damage that bastard can do. Give me the slapbacks. You're gonna get a lot of, uh... You're gonna get a lot of hits, probably. Alright, double slapbacks. I mean, Campion's kind of counts. Spit the roast. There's the block. That was a crit. That hurts. Okay, who's next? Pinky goes last, which has me worried. I feel like he's gonna do some crazy-ass stuff. Yeah, it's more than half your health. Chop me. Nice try, Orc Boy. Noxious Blast. He just used a Plague Doctor move? And healed everyone with it? Oh, God. Thank goodness for the guard. That guard actually just put in a ton of work by getting the slap back and the reflection. Good stuff. Keep the slap back going. We're going to need to find a way to get some stress heal in here somewhere. Yeah, I'm hoping we can take one of these guys out very soon. That'll do! That'll do, Quercus. Heal time. I could go over the stun, but I feel like the heal time... Plus, I want to see what else he can do. I'm morbidly curious. Hit me. Uh-oh. Ah, not me, me! <clears throat> the other me! Cry. He healed us and gave us str What? <laughs> By the way, if you don't know who's going on the thumbnail, it's, it's this guy. Um, 100%. What is this? I, I, I can't tell if I love him or not. Or her? I'm honestly not sure. But it is kind of an amazing creature, regardless of what it wants to be. Minus 20% damage thanks to that crit. Good timing for it, too, although he got the dodge, so who cares? Dance of Pinky. Oh, Lord, he's dancing. Oh, he's not dancing no more! <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> well, he danced for a minute. Alright, this is the perfect chance to get stress heals done. This guy is just weak-ass damage. Worst thing you can do is crit once in a while. I'm not too worried about it. I don't, I don't know what Pinky was, other than amazing, but... That happened. And it was a glorious time. Ah, how? It didn't really hurt that much. Sorry to break it to you. Okay. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Let's go with Ash of the Ashes. There we go. 16. Do I break it down more? I think I do. Hey, I love that zero block team. Get out of my house, please. Thanks. All right. This team continues to be uh, invincible so far. Whoa! A Templar Gladiator and an Oka Savage. Alright, big boy. Uh... I'm worried about the Templar, needless to say. I'm worried about both of them. Let's see, what's our stun chance? 140. You have only one extra stun item. We need to get the other Crimson Court item. Yeah, it's 155. That's not that high. Give me the extra crit, or extra heals. The crit was just a bonus. Yeah, extra heals received, please. You ready for slapbacks? Is this the one that can use revelation? I honestly... Ah, oh, crap. That that move... Oh! Oh, God! A blight of ten! Oh, God! Get rid of it! Proselytize! Please get the, bl the guard! Oh, thank frick. I'll take the pinch! I know that's like 10 bleed as well, but I'll take it to not have to take that hit again. Good lord. I 
Probably should have bandaged there. <laughs> Likely would have been a smart move. Thankfully, he has 40 health still, but still, yikums. Mark this one, please. That does lower his stun resist, too. Body slam for 13 damage. No knockback, got the bleed. Hit him with 30 back. Feeling pretty good. Um, not feeling good health-wise, but we're going to fix that very soon. One more of those should heal up. When to go it to full? Please stop pinching me. All right. Hey, let's let's actually get rid of this now. Keep that prod up. The prod is at max. That's minimum damage in, maximum damage out. War can be healed, but never hidden. All right. How long is the mark? Mark lasts for a couple of rounds. So you know what? This is a chance to actually use the word, the power word. There it is. Right on him. Oh, you know what? That also keeps lowering his stun resist. Thank you for the dodge. Okay, bonk him. Means a solid bonk. Is this literally the only move you can use? It actually absorbed the block that time because it did damage, or at least it tried to. Stun him. There it is. We actually had good stun chance for once, so I had to take it. I bleed for the light. Good thing we have plenty of bandages for the light. Light brand bandages. Get one in an abbey near you. Maximum damage. Minimum frick. I gotta remember I can stack another buff on him soon. Crap. Crap. Wow, he didn't bleed. Nice. Hit me, you bastards. Nice crit. Love it, and that's small heal for everyone, too. Keep stacking this as well. We should be we should be able to stack that pretty high. Uh, proselytize, please. Thank. Worked out perfectly. Well, maybe. Nope, still absorb the block. Damn it. Damn it. Alright, this could get this could get spicy. Good damage back. Okay, he resisted the bleed. That could have gotten spicy really quickly. I'm happy it didn't. Dude, they have not touched Quercus. Or not Quercus. Can't they have touched Quercus? They haven't touched Campion like at all. You think they know? They're acting like they know. I'm just not sure if they know. Anyway, we should be able to finish this dude this round. Uh, give me the single target. Yee. 20 health. He just keeps going at Whoa, baby! Heck yeah, he just keep they just keep going after the first and third rows. It's wild. Alright, you're dead. Bye bye. Oh now you get your free move. Damn it. Okay. That was our uh By the way, that was our fight of regular enemies, so they're getting stronger too. Again? Okay. I'm not complaining about more pinky. Nice dodge. Oh! Considering that was the first move, that was phenomenal. Uh, you know what? Easy stuns. Impressive. Might as well get it. Hit me! Don't be a coward! Just hit me! Or me! There's two of us here. We're ready to be hit. Come at us, bros. Alright, I'm assuming the Berserker's going first. Yep, chop him. Seven damage in? Weak. Oh, he gets stronger with every hit. Of course he does. Is that blast. No effect, practically, other than healing his own team. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, God, 18 damage in. Ouch. Well, that was rough. That was definitely one of the rougher ones. Keep the slapbacks going. We're switching up strategy for this time. We're gonna see if it works out better or worse. Guiding light. Little bit of accuracy for everybody. Maybe a little bit of heals too. The crit went on the wrong person. Both crits went on the wrong people, but that's okay. I'll live with it. Oh no. Damn it, that's a stun. You could, I knew the stun went through because the block icon went away first. 
Well, that tops my frick. Um, get rid of this guy, then. He needs to be our target. He's crying. Someone dodged the cry. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about that. So next thing, he's going to dance, in theory. Frick. Okay, 10 damage on Campion means a lot of damage back. Just enough, baby. Very cool. It eats at mine armor. I'm sorry about your armor. Nice! Slap to the face. Okay. He's got double damage <laughs> for a whole battle. Uh, maybe we stun him. Devastating blow. Yeah, I'll stop him for a bit. Double that, you fool! Double that, you fool! Alright, I feel better now. I feel safer. I still feel safe. Yeah, maybe less safe. Here's the dance! Oh god! Oh no! Whoa! Plus 60% damage for a battle. Yikes! Ashes to ashes, dirt to dirt. Give me them stress heals. Oh, wow. We only got it on one person. That sucked. That sucked quite a bit. Ow. That was actually a lot of damage. Hey, yeah. We'll get rid of it. We'll get rid of it. Okay. You know what? Give me the slap back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Noxious Blast. Okay, so now his moves have uh, gone full circle. Is he going to keep cycling? That's the question. Because if he is, that means the next move is Cry, which is actually very good for us. So we want to keep Pinky alive this upcoming round, in theory. In fact, I have no idea what's going on. So, uh, <laughs> we're all guessing here. Give me that all-team heal. Beautiful. Give me that bonk! Beautiful. Give me the proselytize! Beautiful. And the guard. Okay, is he gonna cry? Ooh! If not, you should think about it. What should I do, Pinky? You gonna dance again? I didn't see that coming. Alright. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Remember, everybody, overconfidence. Something, something we win every time. So let's keep winning. Okay, here's some new ones. A maggot, a thrall, those are not new. A vomiter, and a geist, or geist, whichever you prefer. First of all, get rid of the... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, get rid of the thrall was probably the better one immediately, but... I do want to get rid of this maggot, too. There you go. Okay. I don't remember what this thing does. I just know that it has 75 dodge, and that makes you want to tear my eyes out. This one has a bunch of twos. Feel my agony. Ow. It lowered dodge. Okay, so its dodge goes down over time. Did that get rid of... No, wait, we didn't slap back. Duh. Uh... <laughs> Did that get rid of the slap? No, we didn't actually slap. You can't slap back if you decide if you decided to slap instead. You know what? Stop the vomit. Go for the guiding light. Twenty or ten accuracy will help counter this. Um pretty good damage. One reading of the scroll will get him out of here. Oh god, his agony! Ooh, that's a lot of stress. We might need to counteract that stress instead. Oh, crap. It only lasts for a certain number of rounds. That's not good. That means, at best, he's going to be hovering between 60 and 65 dodge. So I guess our play is to go for stress relief. Bonk. While everyone else tries to take him down. Thankfully, he doesn't have a lot of health. Uh-oh. No agony for me, thank you very much. I'll exercise that agony. Thank you very much. Thou art judged. Hey, 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 and we have judged ourselves into a huge you. Nice. So too will resistance. 
Come on, Resistance. Get your ass over here. Brigan Town Razor. Hunter and a Freischutz? Freischutz? Not 100% sure. Minimum damage, maximum frick. Really wish I'd have gotten the, uh... Nah, the reflection. It's fine, we can always get it later. The Town Razor has... A Ouch! 173 health. I just want to point that out. Alright. Well, Tank Sock, you're definitely going to be on heal duty. We got two people on slapback duty. And then we have the big guy on, oh my god, what is he going to do duty? Thank you for the guard. Kaboom! Oh my god, thank you for the guard! Wow! Holy crap, that could have been awful. I have no idea how much damage that does, but it's probably a ton. That probably would have put him on death's door. It's my initial guess. So that felt really lucky. Uh, mark him. We need to get this guy and his giant nips out of here. Oof, 15 damage. Ouchies. Well, throw that bullet back. <laughs> Get that out of here! <laughs> Get that blanket out of here! And now it's just you and us, big guy. Oh crap, this is his boomstick! 41 damage back! And 16 on top! Frick yeah! Alright, um... Yeah, slap him. Ooh, good slap! Beautiful slap. Break yourselves upon my body. That's a very appropriate sh uh, shout out from Campion. There's always a bright side. I just have to find it. Get him. Oh, wow. I, I thought fever time. What, slapping fever? Because apparently Quercus is better at it than you. Get out of my house! Dude, that guy. Inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. That dude's scary. I don't like the fact that we didn't get a scout here. Should be a battle right before the room. Oh, if there's not, this must be the boss room. Okay. Everyone hold on to your butts. Here we go. The, the prophet. There, behind the pews. It's just the prophet. It's the regular prophet? Huh. So, there's a potential problem here in that we can't have the guard up forever. <laughs> uh, we're gonna see how it goes. Yeah, we can only have it up for a couple rounds. This could, this is not the right team for the fighting the prophet, I don't think, so. This could end up going... Wow. This could end up going very sideways. Okay. Good lord. Really? Okay, at least that made it go toward the front, which is good. Uh, Tank Sock in trouble. Needless to say. Okay, don't worry about the anti-venom, okay? Give me the stress resist. Everyone could use that. Uh, we can... you can use the potions at any time. We're gonna need to remember that. That's a pretty big deal. Um... Yeah, use this. We got the mark, which is the important part. Um... Go ahead and self-heal. Oh, thank you, Tank Sock! You live another day. Maybe. Oh god, the stun! The double stun! Holy crap! 25 damage with 40 protection. Jesus. This... is good. This is very good. Get that protection climbing. This was probably the most fortunate prognostication so far. You notice he hasn't gone after Campion. <laughs> he knows. The ass. Good hit. 
Fulminate. Slap back in eight. Ugh. Blight in eight. Here comes the rubble. Mm. There it is! Okay. Let's see it. Oh, I want to see this. I'm actually going to use the stress relief this time. I'm going to go ahead and use the small healing potion. Make everyone feel a little better. Uh, here, give me a heal as well. There we go. Beautiful. We don't need to worry about his speed or his damage, so this is fine. Alright, big boy. Let's see it happen. Eye on you. Can you not? Hey, uh... Ooh, thank you for not getting stunned. Hey, Quercus, this guy's looking at me funny. Can you help with that? All right. Do it. 50 damage in. Get fucked. <laughs> Did he foresee it? <laughs> I can not. Oh god, that was amazing. Okay. And of course the the regular boss items for the victory here. We brought way too many torches. We're technically done. We can go home. We're gonna go to the end, because I believe there's extra trinkets at the end. But, oh my god, that was amazing. 115 reflection. Is there like a secondary boss or something? I don't remember. Hi. Ah, there it is. The Steel Toad. Three protection. Five dodge in the front. Four accuracy in the back. Less crit on the first round. Why do these epic ones all kind of stink? They all kind of stink. Like, every single one of them. I don't remember if there's anything more back here, but we're, we're gonna find out. Might just be another chest. Oh, it's a hero. Hello there, Falconer. Yeah, get out. Go home. Or wherever you're going. Uh... Don't really need to can- I guess we could get the stress relief. We have last light, so it's not like we're getting hurt. Gathered close in tenuous firelight. Uneasy companionship. I don't think there's anything uneasy about this companionship. These guys are rocking it. Give me a rallying sermon here. It's three speed and ten accuracy for everybody. We can go ahead and give me a prayer here. That's stress. Oh, that's minus stress. And prot for everybody. <laughs> and then go ahead and give me a chant, I guess? For stress resist? He's the one that needs it the most. I'm just trying to optimize this thing here. Extra damage, speed, while, while guarded? Yeah, yeah, actually this should go to you. When to go? And I keep forgetting, but you have a guard too. Which is kind of a big deal. I don't feel like giving up the one attack he has is worth giving up the guard. But I can see where you would try that and have fun with it. Anyway, very wild, very fun dungeon. 21,000, no quest rewards, a blueprint, and a disease. Oh my, how did you know? Pale Man's Plight. Ooh. Fair player, less damage hit stun. That's not a big deal. Weapon Tinker, literally useless. Our family Ooh. Is so well regarded. Is now. Barely whispered aloud by decent folk. This is 10,000 monies and 50 cresties, but I think it's worth it. Maybe. Who, who do we have? For boy? Flambard? Grandcourt? Fitzherbert? Medley? And Norman. Oh, we gotta bring back Norman. It's gotta be Norman. Welcome back, Norman. How was the, you know, dead side of things? I'm sure you weren't thrilled. I'm just going to upgrade him right now. Get it out of the way. You know we're going to do it anyway. And at least upgrade the moves we know we will use almost every time, you know? Which are these two. Probably Exsanguinate. And probably Endure. What's in the Nomad Wagon today? Oh, a nice, uh, wait. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, wait. We have one of these in inventory, don't we? One of these Jade things? I need to look at this. Uh, where's my fish man? 
Fairfax, where you at? I need to look at your trinkets. No, it's a Corsair trinket, isn't it? I forgot you had that fan. Uh, it's a Corsair trinket. We do have a Corsair. We just haven't used them in a while. Buckler. Yeah. So, regular common trinket sells for one, one, two, five. This sells for three. Okay. And it costs eight to buy. So, it's... You can't game the system that much. That's good to know. I guess. I do like gaming the system. Ooh, a hazard mask of the plague doctor. It, it just looks awesome. Heck, you see HP healing received. Very cool. Very cool. Hmm. Some swood uh, cloak and daggers for the grave robber. Unfortunately, we don't have that much stealth going on. Ooh. Stun and blight skill chance as well as damage to range skills for the abominomenon. That's pretty good. And it it basically goes with these chains and this padlock. Wow. It feels like a ton of buffs. I'm buying it. Let's see, sharpening stone for the leper. Parrying dagger for the highwayman. Ooh, stronger slapbacks, extra bleed. That's pretty good. It's good for a specific, you know, loadout, but it's a good loadout. And there's the opposite one, I guess. Powder flask. I'm buying this parrying dagger, too. I don't know if we'll ever use it, but I'm buying it anyway. That's going to be it for this episode of That Plays the Darkest Dungeon. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving it a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more, because it'll keep coming. It won't stop coming, because it's the Darkest Dungeon, and that's what it do. Thanks again for watching. My name is Fett, and I will see you in the next video, everybody. Oh.